Yeshaya, Isaiah chapter 63. Who is this coming from Edom with garments of glowing colors from Bodsra, who was robed in splendor, striding forward in the greatness of his strength? It is I who speak in righteousness, mighty to save. Why is there red on your raiment and your garments like one who treads in the winepress? I have trodden the winepress alone, and from the people no one was with me. And I trod them down in my displeasure, and I trampled them in my wrath. Their blood is sprinkled upon my garments, and I have defiled all my raiment. For a day of vengeance is in my heart, and the year of my redeemed has come. And I looked, but there was none helping, and I was astonished that there was none upholding. So my own right, so my own arm saved for me, and my wrath upheld me. And I trod down peoples in my displeasure, and made them drunk in my wrath, and brought down their strength to earth. Let me recount the loving commitments of Yah, and the praises of Yah, according to all that Yah has done for us, and the great goodness toward the house of Israel, which He has done for them according to His compassion, and according to His many loving commitments. And He said, They are my people, children who did not act falsely. And He became their Savior. In all their distress he was distressed, and the messenger of his presence saved them. In his love and in his compassion he redeemed them, and he lifted them up and carried them all the days of old. But they rebelled and grieved his set-apart spirit, so he turned against them as an enemy, and he fought against them. Then he remembered the days of old, Moshe, his people. Where is he who brought them up out of the sea with the shepherd of his flock? Where is he who put his set-apart spirit within him, who led them by the right hand of Moshe, with his comely arm dividing the water before them to make for himself an everlasting name, who led them through the deep? Like a horse in the wilderness they did not stumble. As a beast goes down into the valley, and the spirit of Yah causes him to rest, so you led your people to make yourself a comely name. Look down from the heavens and see from your set-apart and comely dwelling where are your ardor and your might, the stirring of your inward parts and your compassion toward me. Are they withheld? For you are our father, though Abraham does not know us, and Israel does not recognize us. You, O Yah, are our father, our redeemer. Your name is from of old. O Yah, why do you make us stray from your ways and harden our heart from your fear? Turn back for the sake of your servants, the tribes of your inheritance. For a little while your set-apart people possessed it. Our adversaries have trodden down your set-apart place. We have become like those over whom you never ruled. Your name is not called on them.